Hello YouTube. Hi, how's everyone out there today? I'm coming with a video, um, a review video on some hair that I purchased off Amazon. And y'all, um, I've noticed dealing with wigs on Amazon, it's like a hit and miss. Um, so really, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's a hit and miss. Sometimes you can get a good company and their hair is every bit 150 density. Then sometimes you can get in and be thin as hell and they say 150 density, but you know, it's like maybe 130 if that. Um, so I wanted to come and do these wig reviews of these um, wig companies that are selling wigs through Amazon. And I'm going to tell you a little bit about my experience with each one of them because People need to know, like, if they're putting 150 density on, who are we to know what 150 density is? I'm telling you, from somebody that makes wigs and that purchased a lot of wigs and have worn a lot of um, extensions, wigs, whatever, um, I can feel what I pretty much would say is 150 density. Um, for instance, this unit I just purchased, um, I think I got it last weekend. I just put it in. The color is amazing. I think it's cute, but I'm going to tell you a little bit about this company. And then you go from there, whether you want to purchase this hair or not. Um, and actually, I just crimped it because it really doesn't come like this. Um, I have to fix the front. Um, the color is pretty. Although I, I really don't care for those really thick chunks of highlights. I wish they would have did it thinner. But it's cute. It really is cute. I'm going to add me another bundle. I think I'm going to buy like two more bundles and add to this because it's a super thin. But the color is really, it's pretty light. That's the only thing that messed up to me with with this wig was um, it's just super thin. Um, I'm trying to find my information now to tell you a little bit about this wig right here that I purchased on Amazon. I have a new phone, y'all, and um, okay, here it is. This wig um, is, no, I don't have time to do all that right now. What? Okay, I don't know what you're talking about. So, this phone is getting on my nerves. Boy, I tell you, I'm so spoiled by iPhones now. It's like, child, don't nothing compare to an iPhone. I don't care what nobody say. No nothing compared to an iPhone. I'm so spoiled by my iPhone and my i uh my Apple devices. Oh, but anyway, um, this hair right here is by Sparkle Diva Store. Um, it's Sparkle Diva Store on Amazon, and um, it's a it's a four twenty seven. Um, that's the color four slash twenty seven. HD transparent lace front. I do not like the HD transparent lace fronts. Um, they be too white. Um, they be too white for me. Um, and then, then you can really see it. But I have some spray that I just spray on the inside of my cap. And it actually, um, even though I'm real fair complected, as you can see, you can see it right now because I don't have that camouflage too good because I didn't put my spray on there. Because last time it seemed like when I put my spray on the inside of my cap, I had a hard time um, it um, trying to blend in. I, I like to melt my tracks. On, like, I be melting my lace. But um, I, I seem like I need to go back in and color the, um, the um, spray the inside so it can um, blend effortless, effortlessly into my color, my skin color, and it can blend. But right now you can see where it's cut off right there. But I know how to fix all of that. But anyway, this is um, 
Like I said, it's by Sparkle Diva Store. And I have a good outcome with them. I reached out to them and the number that they left, um, the WhatsApp number that they left, it said that it could not be, um, when I put it in my WhatsApp, it, it, it gave me an error. Like it couldn't receive, um, they could not receive um, messages from their email. I mean, from their WhatsApp. And also I reached out to them, emailed, emailed them and they have not, um, emailed me back. They have not emailed me back. Um, and I really wanted to give them a good review, but when they did not even reach out to me and that the number that they have on WhatsApp is not even reachable, I'm like, that's bad customer service. I shouldn't have to go through all this to get in touch with y'all. Y'all did not email me back. I emailed y'all twice. I called, um, I'm very disappointed in this hair. Um, this hair is very, very thin. This wig is very, very thin. And on the, um, when you go on Amazon and you look it up and you pull it up on Amazon, I, I see in the description, they say that it gets thicker as you come in and brush it. They're lying. It does not get thicker as you come in and brush it. I don't brush this because usually when you do brush out, um, hair, it does make it thicker, especially if it's got some kind of curl texture to it. it it'll, it'll make it feel fuller. It has not, I've had this in there for a week. I've even crimped it. Usually when I crimp, when I crimp hair, it really fluffens it up and make it thicker. It, nothing has made this hair no thicker than when I pulled it out that thing. This is a ponytail, y'all. Hold on. I'm coming in with my hair because now I ain't gonna lie, it's really soft. It's really pretty. I didn't really get um I didn't get any um um shedding. I didn't really get no shedding for real for real. Um so that's good. Um it's thin, but the hair is really soft, the color is really pretty. I will order for them again. I just know to I'm already going to know to add me like another bundle too. And, and I'm the type that I know when you purchasing wigs, it's not going to be full, full, full. You're not going to get your, um, you're not going, they're not going to give you that much hair on there. And I understand the longer it is, the, you know, the thinner it is, but this hair is not that long. This hair, I think is a, a 24 inch, 24 inch that I purchased because they didn't have a 26 inch. So this is a 24 inch, I believe. The length, I'm very pleased because normally when I buy a wig on Amazon, even though they say to stretch it, if it's got curl in it and measure it, it don't be it don't be true to its length. The color be off, it always be something. But this hair, I'm like, oh my God, I could have gave y'all five stars. Like this hair, I love it. I love the color. Um, although I'm gonna experiment with it. I'm gonna um, order me some bundles online. And I'm going to put more, um, maybe blonde up through here. I'm going to put, um, I'm going to add me another bundle too. But y'all, this feel like one bundle. I promise you, this is the ponytail. Look how thin the ponytail is. Look how thin it is. I don't know if it looks thin on camera, but y'all, it's thin. It's thin. And it's real big head friendly, which I have a small head. I have a huge forehead, but I have a small head and I don't like a lot of extra cap. Um, so this is, I would say it's big hair friendly. Although the cap construction is really, really, really comfortable. And they have a lot of cones in it. I think you got your two on the side. They even got one up in the crown area that's new. I'm like, okay. So they got a uh, comb in the crown area. Then they have the adjustable straps. And I'm gonna show you the back of this hair, y'all. I'm gonna show you how long the back is. This is a 20. 24 inch i want to say i don't think it was 26 i think it was 24 inch i'm gonna show you the length how it looks in the back let's see can you can you see okay so it's really pretty i had no issues with tangling or anything i had crimped it earlier and i didn't put it you see it's almost to my my butt. So the, the length is great. Usually I get, like I said, I buy these wigs and the length is off. The length is not as long. They charge you for a longer length, but it don't be that length. But this, I can admit, this is pretty long. Um, So it's true to its length. The only issue I have with y'all is that you guys, 
the wig is thin. Like if y'all add another bundle on a wig or even a half of a bundle, make me feel like I got my money's worth. Like y'all really skimped out on the hair, but the color is pretty. Um, and I'm going to pull it up again, the name of this company. I will purchase from them again. Um, I just know, like I said, to have me, uh, a extra bundle too. I'm gonna add me a, a couple of extra bundles to have on standby, but I paid $188 for it. Um, so I paid $188 for it. In all, I paid like two something. Um, I'm trying to find the name, y'all. Um, again, it is Sparkle Diva Store. It's called the Sparkle Diva Store. It says visit, visit the Sparkle Diva Store. So you can actually pull them up online and you can go on Amazon and pull it up. Um, and it came in this, um, it gave, it gave me a stocking cap. Stocking cap had two stocking caps in it. It didn't give me any free lashes or anything like that. The only thing it came with was stock a stocking cap, some stocking caps, a couple of stock, a pack, one pack with two stocking caps in it. And it came in this little box. And I see that they don't really have a name on it. They don't even really have a name on this box. They don't have their name on this box. I don't know. Now, you know what? They told me to contact us and get $10. I reached out to y'all. I emailed y'all twice and no one emailed me back. I called on WhatsApp and no, and it wasn't a reachable number. So they show putting a lot of, you'll get um, uh, $10 cash back. And it was something else they were saying um, that they'll give you back a free wig if you qualify for a free, oh, here it is right here. Um, if you qualify for a free weed, you, you qualify for this free weed, free gift. And they trying to give you this weed right here, which ain't nobody trying to wear this ancient mama looking weed. Girl, child, please. Who wearing their hair like this? Who but me ain't finna wear no weed like this. I might as well wear my own hair if I'm gonna wear, wear this. I wouldn't dare buy a weed that look like this. I don't like short weeds anyway, but, um, and it says the emails M ljbeauty at outlook.com like i said i contacted them twice no one ever gave me a call back um then they have an iMessage number which is the same as the whatsapp but it's just i don't know i don't know this what, let me tell y'all y'all people that be selling these wigs and units on amazon like customer service is everything if you leave a number you leave a number or email for us to contact you and then we can't contact you. It's making me feel like you took our money and you don't really care about any problems that we have with the unit after we get it. That's what it looked like to me with this. Um, the wig is very skimpy. Um, it's very, very thin. I can't stress that enough. I, I I really sometimes don't even like running my hands through it because it feels so thin, y'all. It's like I want to just take it down and just add me another bundle on there just so I can I don't have to feel how thin this is. Like I can't believe y'all tried this. I can't believe y'all really tried this. Like, look, this one side, this other side. And I'll, I, it may not look thin to y'all, but it's really thin. Only reason why it don't look thin is because I put them crimps in there. And them crimps give it some kind of texture, but it really is thin, y'all. But other than that, the cap construction is really, it's really comfortable. Like, it was really shot. Like, the cap construction is very, very comfortable. It feels really good on my head. Um... I love the inside of the cap construction. I could tell it was it was really done real real nicely. Out of other wigs that I've tried, um, it's just really it fits really good on the inside. It feels really good. It's real comfortable. Like I said, the color is pretty. I like the color. Okay, um, the hair is not tangling up or anything like that. I haven't put any oils or anything on there, which I should have put a um, a heat protector on there before I crimped it, but I didn't. Um, 
but normally I put a heat protector on my wigs um, and then I curl it flat iron or crimped or whatever. But I always put that heat protector on it. I didn't this time. And I, I won't do that again because it really dries the wig out when you do that. That heat really dries it out and then it makes it not as, uh, then, it start, then you start having problems with it being tangly because it's dry and the hair is not treated right. So um, I'm going to put a little oil on it. I've had it in there not even a week. But like I said, they said that it would thicken up as you brush and comb it. It, it does not. It's going to stay this, this right here. It's not thick at all. So um, that's the only problem, like just it being thin as hell. Like the wig is really, really thin. It's really thin. Like y'all could have put another half a bundle on this unit. You could have like... You really could have put an extra, but, but that's that's Amazon wigs for you. It's like a hit and miss with Amazon. It's like a hit and miss with Amazon. But again, that company's called Sparkle Diva. Um, and girl, they got this wig looking so thick on this mannequin and on this girl. See, that's what made me mad too with y'all. Y'all will put, y'all will get pictures of somebody after they done added a whole two bundles on a wig and then take a picture and put it on there. Y'all want to show that or y'all want to get a mannequin and get the wig and add like two, three bundles and then take a picture of that. Y'all need to stop doing that. I'm going to start calling y'all. I'm going to start calling y'all, um, y'all, um, these, these, these retailers out on Amazon that, that do that. Because really and truly, you should, it, that mannequin, this mannequin right here, this mannequin, this this right here, no, you know good and well that that wig that you sold me is not as thick as these two wigs right here. This shit don't even look like the same damn wig. Get the hell out of here. Stop, stop, stop damn keying on the damn, um, on the people's time. She. Y'all snap up here lying to these folks and they paying over 200 something dollars, damn near $300 for these units and they coming out thin as hell. Like, that ain't right. Y'all gooping the girls now. Look at this thin ass. I started to say something. Look at this thin ass shit. This shit look thin, y'all. It's thin. You Now you can see how really how thin it is. When I go down and look, if I, if this going to really show you how thin it is, when I do this little, look at this little twist. You can tell by the twist. Look how thin that twist is, child. And this is the, this is the whole left side. This one, this one, and this was thicker. Cause I don't have it parted. It's as a child. You could then that was wrong for that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna um order me another bundle of this and I'm just going to um I'm not gonna sew it in, I'm gonna glue it in. Um I think I'm gonna glue it in. I'm just gonna glue me some tracks, like maybe um Maybe about 10 tracks, probably a whole bundle and a half, but I'm gonna add to it. Other than that, I love the wig. I'll be rocking it for a minute. Um, I just, I don't like the transparent lace. I think it's a little bit too light, but like I said, I didn't spray my, um, spray that I normally spray on there. My, they, they do have, um, lace front tint, um, spray. And I do have me some in a, it's, it's, um, light brown. And I spray my caps with it and it, it helped blend in the HD lace. But I, I don't know, for some reason, I'm not feeling this HD lace. To me, that it stands out more than it, than a regular lace. I don't know. Um, yeah, I'm not going to lie to y'all. I was wearing synthetic wigs that looked just so super cute. Like you couldn't tell my synthetic wigs from real hair. And I did purchase some, um, human hair wigs, but a lot of the wigs that I did wear were synthetic. And I ain't gonna lie, I had that, I had the um, lace melted so good, I promise you couldn't tell if it was my hair or a wig, I promise you. But 
with these human hair wigs, I noticed their their lace is harder to melt. And I don't know, like, I use wig tape. So maybe that has something to do with me being able to blend it. I believe if I use that glue, because I do have some um, bowl hole, but I believe I'm going to... I'm going to try when I do take this out and add some tracks to it. I'm going to try using Boho and see if it will blend it in, melt it better than me using the wig tape. I just swear by wig tape and I love wig tape because wig tape, I can actually still take my hot, hot, hot baths and my steaming hot showers with wig tape on and it's not going to come off. And, um... Even if it start lifting a little bit, it's because you're hot. But as soon as you cool off, it's going to melt right back to your, you know, to your head. So that's why I like um, wig tape because you don't have to worry about sweating and it lifting. And wig tape, you can wear it for weeks um, and take it off. You know what I'm saying? The only thing that's going to take the wig tape off is alcohol. And I love wig tape. So that's why I wear wig tape. But for some reason, human hair, um, the human hair... Wigs that I've been buying on Amazon, it's it's been hard for me to melt the um the lace onto my my forehead to my skin. It's, I don't know. It's like I'm having a problem melting to make it look real. Like I mean, I don't know. I I don't know what's going on. If it's these HD transparent lace, maybe I need to stay away from that. That's the second lace wig I done bought that was HD transparent, and I ain't feeling the transparent lace. I don't know. Do y'all y'all tell me? If y'all like the transparent lace, the ladies, um, I'm not feeling transparent lace. And um, it's just, it's harder for me to blend right up in here. I'm not feeling it. And I think the next wig I'm going to order, I actually have a wig company right now that that wants me to do a YouTube video for their company. They're, um, they really want to do a YouTube video. They're supposed to be sending me a, a, a wig, actually. And I've bought a wig from them before. I don't have all the information in front of me, but I'll do that on the next video. And they're pretty good. I, I like their wig. It was it was pretty thick. Um, it was a good wig. I can't really complain. It had that HD lace that I don't like. Um, yeah, but it was it was way it was thicker than this. It was it was thicker than this, but then again, it was shorter than this. But I ain't gonna lie, this right here, this is giving me 26, 28 inches, but this is really only just 24 inches, y'all. I love their I love their length. Like there is true to they're true to their length. And that's hard to come by messing around with an Amazon. Um a wig on Amazon, it's hard to buy a wig on Amazon and it be its true length. Like they'll tell you it's a 28. Or they'll tell you it's a 26 and it'd be looking like a 20. You know what I'm saying? So I'm really surprised that this length is as long as it as long as it is. But like I said, I am definitely gonna have to add a bundle or two in there. Um, and also the transparent lace is is just I don't like it. I don't like the transparent lace. I really don't know. Um but I also like wearing um, wigs that have a side. I don't know. I can really rock the right part side of a wig, like a deep part side. That's what I normally wear anyway, like a deep a deep side part wig. I really don't care for the middle parts. And with these, you can't make them um, side wigs. They're not like 360s. They're not like wigs where you can... Um, why well, take that back? You can put your part anywhere. This right, this that I have is a four by four, so it's actually a middle part wig. So you really can't put um, a part on the side if you wanted to. But the next wig I get, I am gonna get a wig where I can part it on the side. I just rather prefer to have a side part wig. It helps me blend it in even more um, than this right here. I don't. I don't know. I gotta find the perfect wig, y'all. I gotta find a perfect wig that lace is just gonna give me that ultimate blend like how my synthetic wigs my synthetic wigs my my side parts and my middle parts of my synthetic wigs i promise you y'all those wigs i melted them so good they look like my real hair and for some reason these human hair wigs i've been purchasing 
Like the lace is the only thing that's throwing everything off. Like I can't, for some reason, melt them like these lace, this lace, like I do the synthetic weed. I don't know why. I don't, I don't know. I don't know if it's this H, like I said, it's H, this HD transparent lace. I'm not really feeling that kind of lace. I'm not feeling the lace. Just give me the regular lace. Like I don't like this HD transparent. It ain't, it ain't working for me, but yes, y'all. So anyway, you can find some good wigs on Amazon, but, um, you just gotta look at you gotta really look at the reviews. Look at the reviews. That's what I look at. How many reviews they have. And I, I noticed something else too. A lot of these hair companies, they use the same pictures on the, with their companies. Like I noticed that. I seen like a wig I supposed to have been purchasing, it supposed to have been that wig. And then I seen it on another wig with another company that was um advertising a totally different wig. And I'm just like, so they sometimes they float, they use the same pictures and they try to make it seem like that's the weed that you purchasing that's the weed you're gonna get and it's false advertisement it, it, it don't be that weed and you get it you be messing up and then be trying to reach out to them customer service can't reach out to nobody because they don't have no good customer service so that's it on this video y'all um like i said you can go on amazon and i'm gonna give you the name one more time I said savvy something, then I y'all. Sparkle is the name of it. It's called the Sparkle Diva Store. The Sparkle Diva Store. Tell them to reach out to me, y'all. Tell the Sparkle Diva Store. I emailed them. They did not reach out to me. The WhatsApp number, I can't get through on that WhatsApp number. I don't know what's going on with that. But um Yeah, yeah. That's 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 the company. So, you know, if you like if you like this this particular unit right here, um, it is a 427. Um, the color is pretty it's pretty, y'all. It's got like three different colors going on. That's what that's what I really liked about it. You got your dark brown, you got your blonde, and then you got a reddish looking 30. You got your little 30 right here. You're supposed to be your fourth. I love the color. It's pretty. And I actually looked on Amazon and, and found some tra um bundles that were um made just like this too. I was like, oh, that'll fit in that wig perfectly. So like I said, I'm gonna order a, I'm gonna order two bundles and um, add to this wig and come back and show y'all how it looks once I add it to it. This wig is fire, y'all. Like I said, only thing you gotta do is add you a couple of bundles. You'll be in there. You'll be good if you add you two bundles in here. It'll make it real thick. Cause right now it's not super, super, it's thin, but I can really see adding another bundle. Oh, and then you add two, you in the game for sure, baby. But yeah, thank y'all for tuning in and um, I will catch y'all on the next one. Have a good day. Bye-bye.